E hey, aí pessoal, sejam bem-vindos a Persona 5 Royal No episódio passado nós finalmente conseguimos o nome do nosso alvo Junya Kaneshiro O líder da máfia que terá o seu coração roubado pelos Phantom Thieves muito em breve O único problema é que seu palace meio que voa e nós não mas bem, eu vou pelo menos estudar um pouco aqui agora e... Talvez com esse estudo eu fique inteligente o suficiente para saber como escalar um prédio de 20 andares e subir em uma plataforma voadora. I've been thinking lately about those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if he would have been on their side. That's all. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. That's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just really tired. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. I just remembered. Eu tenho visto um monte de programas na TV sobre os Phantom Thieves of Hearts ultimamente. Por que será que eles roubam corações? Você não pode fazer nada com eles. Eles não têm nenhum valor monetário ou coisa assim. Se eles tivessem, eu diria que seria algo parecido com o valor do ouro ou coisa do tipo. Isso, professora Osami. Continue dando aula enquanto todos prestam atenção na sua incrível voz. Opa! Falando nisso, tem um outro tipo de metal que é tão valioso quanto, só que do seu próprio jeito. Eu tô resfriado, não sei porque eu tô fechando meu nariz com a mão pra fazer isso. Eles chamam de minérios é, é, mínimos. Na verdade, você provavelmente tem um com, ele, com você hein, agora. Nos seus bolsos ou nas suas bolsas. Você está prestando atenção, tá com a Maxa? Me dê um exemplo de alguma coisa que você esteja carregando agora com metais mínimos. Hã? Oh, uh... Ei, hey, a Lirian tá em apuros. É bom você ajudar ela. Ah, eu não faço ideia. Qual é? Ela tá na cara. Ah, desculpa, Jack. Será que você pode me ajudar? Mano. Alguma coisa que usa metais mínimos e que provavelmente ele está carregando agora. Ah, tá legal. Eu tenho um batom, meu celular e uma máscara. Um, um, uma máscara de maquiagem, eu acho. O que, que você acha, Jack? Pelo amor de Deus, cara. É nessa hora que esse jogo duvida da sua inteligência. Mas, de novo... Eles têm razão por duvidar da sua inteligência, porque afinal você joga pra sua provavelmente você gosta da Futaba, então... Ah, o meu celular? Ah, sim! Ela disse eletrônico, não é? É. Então a resposta é o meu celular, professora. Precisamente. Muitos dos metais mínimos são escavados na China. Alguns países produzem muito mais do que outros. 90% dos metais mínimos usados no Japão são importados. Mas um monte de lixo reciclado que nós jogamos fora contém metade mínimos também. Em outras palavras, um depósito de lixo é muito mais valioso do que o coração de alguém. Uh, muito obrigado pela ajuda! Obrigadinha! Valeu você, hein? Graças a isso eu ganho um pouco de charme. Você é muito inteligente, viu? Vou te contar! Caramba, Jack! É... Acertar essa do celular foi super complicado mesmo. Eu tive que pôr toda a minha cabeça pra funcionar. 
We ain't got nothing. Are we out of luck? It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro, hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Huh, that's so. You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. Useless? Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. To be frank, yes. Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop, since you're so good at it? <sighs> so you wish to get in contact with Kanashiro? That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. Hey, you don't gotta answer her honestly! So, you're, you're just, just the just good girl just type that I push over. Right now, you're useless to me. I'm not. What was that? Fine. I'll help you meet Kanashiro. What exactly is she planning on doing? She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kanashiro may be? I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Ugh, what is up with her? There are way too many people here. <sighs> We're never gonna find her. Hello, it's me, Makoto Nijima. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kanashiro? What? That idiot! What's she doing? I heard I could find someone named Kanashiro if I came to Central Street. Central Street? She's being too rash. What are you getting at? He's blackmailing the students at Shujin Academy, is he not? Tell him if he doesn't want me talking to the police about it, he better agree to meet with me. You got a death wish or something? He says he'll meet you. Get in. You better be taking me to Kanashiro. He said get the fuck in! Wasn't that... It's the guys that messed with us the other day. So they were connected to Kanashiro. Is she still on? Contact Kanashiro-san. Tell him we got a good one. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kanashiro-san's customer. Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them! Ryuji, get a taxi. I'll... Okay, I've got their license plate. My sketching skills will come in handy. Ah, shit, he ignored me! Damn it, I said stop! Ryuji! Hurry up and get in! So, you're seriously the student council president of Shujin. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So, whose number is this? Your boyfriend? What in the world? Who the fuck are you? Nijima-san! What the hell did you do to her? Oh, I get it. You got followed, you dumb shits! Holy That bag you saw the other day, the crocodile one, how much was it? Mm, about three million. Ah! <gasps> For real? 
Better thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. It pisses me off even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? Uh, that's... Oh, damn, I got booze and cigs in the shot. Maybe some drugs, too. Ah, oh, this is so hilarious. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police, and I'll break all of you, starting with your families. I want to give you the usual month, but well, you have such a large group here. Three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. <laughs> For real. I was stupid. I must agree. You should have easily imagined this happening. Hey, Yusuke! I was so caught up in trying to be useful. All right, enough of the blame game. It's done is done. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job and... She's a much more remarkable person than me. A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. But I'm still a child. So all I am is a burden to her. Hmm. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. <sighs> People like me, must really be what others call scum of the earth. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that, and I do too. Takamaki-san. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me... either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. So can we please just drop the case with Kaneshiro? No can do. We're all caught up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuji! Bank? Oh, right! The bank! She isn't useless at all! She may be our key in! Hear me out, you guys. Our key in? What do you mean? A cat? Um, are you all okay? We've become Kaneshiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kaneshiro's bank! I see. 
The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. And wouldn't you say that she in particular is a special customer? Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. Whoa, I don't follow this at all. She risked her life doing something so reckless. At the very least, she has the right to know. Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? Yeah, where are we going? Beats me. A canine? It's Fox. Be quiet. The shadows are going to notice us. A monster cat? I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice... Takamaki-san? Where are we? We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well, the world inside his heart. What? It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Another reality? It's floating in the air. Th this is reality? <sighs> My goodness. <sighs> I I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists, I can't doubt it. A reality that one's heart shows. Is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? That's something we have no idea about. I see. So stealing one's heart, that may be like overriding their cognition. I think I kind of get the logic behind it. Ain't she more amazing than you? We're about the same! Then... Does that mean there's an ATM version of myself somewhere in this world, too? Perhaps. Regardless, we can change Kaneshiro's heart and make him confess if we steal his treasure. If it all goes well, that is. <laughs> we'll make it go well. Everyone will notice us for sure if we take someone like Kaneshiro down. Our justice will also become resolute. Think we'd be able to give courage to those in need if it happens? For the sake of those in need, huh? You sound like my father. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. If I've become a customer of that bank, then they'll have to let me in. For real? It came to us! It's just as I calculated. You know how you can use your card to get into banks during after hours? I thought that I'd be able to get in, since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue after all. Oh, that makes sense. But wow, this place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. Being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious. We are totally robbers. You got that right. It seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on. Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer, so I better act like one. I will be useful for you guys. Come on, let's go. Muito bem, vamos entrar. E aqui estamos nós, finalmente dentro do palácio de Kaneshiro com a Makoto. Cara, essa garota não tá para brincadeira. Ela vai sim ser útil para nós. Eu tenho certeza disso. A minha mente está decidida. Vamos entrar. Esse seria o cliffhanger perfeito para esse episódio. 
Cara, eu poderia simplesmente encerrar ele por aqui, mas... Ainda falta um pouco pra terminarmos esse episódio. Bom, apenas dei uma boa olhada nesse lugar. Em quão incrível é o design aqui do lado de fora com essas árvores de notas e tudo mais. E vamos entrar. What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. No, no, wait! She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let him pass. That voice. It's Kaneshiro. Yo, banks have presidents? Yes, but not the political sorts, in theory. Por favor, espere! A recepção fica bem à direita, lá nos fundos. Eu recomendo que você não vá para nenhum outro lugar. Ok, não é como se eu tivesse a intenção de ir para outro lugar sem ser à direita. Vamos para a esquerda, Feather Tips! Ok, brincadeira, vamos lá. Uh... Oh, ok, eu acho que esse cara só vai me dar outro conselho. Ele não parece ser uma ameaça. A recepção fica bem ali naquela porta. Tá ah, mal, vamos passar. Onde está a recepção, galera? Outro guarda. Recepção está à direita. Não vamos para nenhum outro lugar. Tá ah, mal. Incredible. É, nem fala, Makoto. Cara, que lugar enorme. Meu Deus do céu. Esse passe vai ser demais. Atenção, recepção! Que braço, entre! Tá bom. É assim? Você não vai nem abrir a porta pra um convidado? Ah. Moço, não tem ninguém aqui dentro. Apenas uma bagatela de dinheiro. How many beef bowls could I eat with this? Unauthorized injury, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to 3 million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off then? No, a loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 10% interest a day? Um, uh, that means uh, one day is... It's 300,000 yen. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are such great assets. They lack strength, be it social, physical, or mental. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kaneshiro! We're gonna snatch your treasure from you! Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. E agora a coisa vai finalmente começar. Nossa primeira batalha no palácio de Kaneshiro contra dois Zones. Eles não estão aqui pra brincadeira, eles dão bastante dano se você deixar. Então eu vou tentar sempre usar o eletrocutar pra poder dar um dano neles que deixa eles paralisados, talvez. 
Porém, nem sempre vai dar certo Eles têm resistência a físico, se eu não me engano Eu posso confirmar isso agora Com o Victor Strike do... É, eu sabia Ok Então, na próxima vez, ou eu uso o Victor Strike Ou posso usar o próprio Mabu Fui Ou... Oh, oh, what the fuck? Ok, isso foi... Meu Deus, isso foi incrível Phantom Tips Bom trabalho, galera Vamos finalizar eles agora Legal, e aí tá mais uma onda deles Vamos continuar com a mesma estratégia Usando o Mazu pra poder Tanto conservar o nosso SP por causa da nossa habilidade De trait do Orobas Quanto pra poder conseguir esse efeito De eletrocutado pra eles não poderem atacar no turno deles E também conseguir um técnico No turno do Yusuke, que é o que mais vale a pena aqui Pois com o Maragi agora da Yen E o Vicious Strike, talvez não seja o suficiente Pra derrotar eles, mas Vai com certeza ser o suficiente pra eles conseguir um Battle Pass E passar para o Joker Porque assim no próximo Battle Pass e no próximo dano que o Joker der, vai ser o suficiente para finalizar isso daqui. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run. Did the security guards turn into monsters? And what were those supernatural powers? Could those have been the personas you mentioned? Does now really look like the time to be asking that? We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Hurry, Joker. The exit's just over there. You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <gasps> Managing a bank is tough as it is. So, it's my policy to kill clients who are more trouble than they're worth. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please, stop! Oh, I wouldn't damage an asset like you. They're dead men walking, but you'll be just fine. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful, if only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn 3 million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. <laughs> I've been listening to you go on and on. Shut your damn mouth, you money-grubbing asshole! <laughs> Have you decided to tread the path of strife? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell? A persona? No, dude. 
That's a bike. I can feel it. Myself. Me. Hard again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non stop. Right, Johanna? <laughs> Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice. Let's go, Johanna! Full throttle! The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. Assim que se fala. Depois de ser reprimida pela sua irmã e pelos outros acima de você, é hora de se soltar, mostrar a sua rebelião e usar o seu persona, Johanna, para acabar com essas Shadows bem na sua frente. Nós vamos começar usando uma Frey, porque é a fraqueza dessa Shadow bem do meio e nós vamos deixar o resto dos Zones apenas tomando dano, conseguir um Battle Pass com a própria Makoto e então poder prosseguir com a batalha. A gente conseguiu o Wick, maravilha, isso vai nos garantir um Battle Pass agora para o Joker, que vai dar um bom dano nas três Shadows bem na nossa frente. Vamos começar usando o Mazu também para tentar eletrocutá-las, não foi o suficiente, mas não tem problema, já demos um bom dano, o Magaro agora do Mona... Não foi suficiente pra finalizar, o que é um problema, porque agora é a vez desse cara. Ele vai usar a mão full. Aguentei firme. Droga. A Makoto, ela tá congelada, não. Ah, não. Ok. Ah, talvez ele não, se não tenha sido o melhor início de carreira dela. Eu, eu vou admitir. Mas não tem problema. É a primeira vez dela. Eu, eu tenho que considerar isso. Não tinha como ela saber. Ela é nova aqui. Ah, é. Eu, eu, vou, eu vou usar o seu turno. Não tem jeito. Eu não posso deixar de jeito nenhum a Makoto morta. Não na estreia dela. <risos> ah, cadê? Eu preciso de algum Revival Beast, maravilha. Toma aí, Makoto. Nada aconteceu, ok? Ninguém viu nada, relaxa. <risos> Vamos usar o Frey aqui de novo pra poder derrubar esse cara. E talvez finalizar já com essa batalha. Não, ainda tá muito longe de finalizar, mas a gente vai conseguir um Hold Up. Um All Out Attack com a Makoto. Cara, eu não podia estar mais ansioso pra esse momento do jogo. Eu adoro a parte em que ela se rebela contra tudo que estava... Colocando ela reprimida E mostrar a sua verdadeira cara Não só como presidente do conselho estudantil Mas também como uma cotonismo Adolescente que Quer viver um pouco a sua vida Não pelos outros e Droga, cara, ela tomou um pouco de dano Mas ela não foi congelada dessa vez O que significa que ela ficou com 6 de HP Ok, isso não foi muito bom Poderia tentar dar um buff de buff aqui Mas, sinceramente eu acho que o Frazier deve ser mais do que o suficiente. Ele vai nos garantir um Rick nessa Shadow. E agora, com o Alor Attack, nós devemos finalizar isso. Agora, vamos sair But how are we getting out? There's only one exit, right? So, you're totally the fist of the Phantom Star now, huh? Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality. Nor will you break through the security system here. It doesn't matter what you do. You can kiss your bright futures goodbye. was no Aikido. That was some hardcore ass whooping. I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. This is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. 
but it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the phantom thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the phantom thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but... There are times I feel sorry for her too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great! We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. Cara, motos são iradas! Eu queria que uma pessoa fosse assim. Mas o seu persona é um barco. Cara, tá zoando. Motos são bem mais maneiras do que barcos estúpidos. Eu sei que nem aquela música. Eu sou um fantasma no meu cavalo de aço. Não diga coisas assim. E só pra constar, eu certamente não sou procurada. Ah, deve ser uma referência ao filme. Honestamente, eu acho que só estou surpresa com você sabendo dirigir uma motocicleta em cima. É, você tem uma licença? Uma normal, sim. Maneiro. Mal vejo a hora de pôr as minhas mãos e uma também. Bom. Deixando isso de lado, se importa se mudar de assunto? Qual é o problema? Eu sinto muito, pessoal. Eu sei que eu não estou em posição de dizer isso agora. Eu realmente sei. Mas eu tenho que pedir desculpas. As minhas ações foram o que trouxeram toda essa bagunça para nós. E além disso, eu julguei mal vocês pelas suas intenções. Se ao menos eu tivesse percebido isso quando estava tudo acontecendo com a Suzui. Não se preocupa, não é hora de falar disso agora. Parece que alguns assuntos continuam martelando na cabeça de todos nós. Ah, relaxa. Agora não é hora de falar sobre esse tipo de coisa. Não temos que fazer alguma coisa contra o Kaneshiro. É, ele tá certo. Muito bem. Entendido. Enfim. Eu farei o meu melhor para não atrasar vocês, pessoal. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a while ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. Nice! Makoto parece do tipo que dá uns conselhos bem confiáveis. Mas agora nós estamos contra o verdadeiro criminoso. Fica com o pé no chão, entendeu? Ei, uma outra caixa chegou pra você. Yay! Esquece o Kareshiro, vamos pegar presente. Ok. <risos> Bom, pessoal. Eu acho que é isso. Nós temos uma nova deadline vindo aí. Com três semanas para entregar 3 milhões de yen para Kareshiro. O líder da máfia. As coisas não vão ser fáceis. Vamos ter que trabalhar bastante na Triple Seven se eles quiserem juntar esse dinheiro. Ou oh, não! Ah... Uh... 
Talvez a gente só queira roubar o seu coração mesmo. Enfim. Eu vou encerrar esse episódio por aqui. Eu espero que vocês tenham gostado. E é claro, um grande agradecimento especial aos membros de Phantom Thief que apoiam esse canal de forma financeira. Que é Spider, Panda Pop, Lobinho Taquinha, Gyu, Kono Renda, Jordana Garcia, Joker Akira, Kaguso no Kara e o Harry Oliveira. Pessoal, eu vejo vocês no próximo episódio. Muito obrigado por assistirem. E até lá. Tchau, tchau.